Hey, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to unboxing number 122. I am very tired, so I am going to drink some Diet Mountain Dew Code Red. <sighs> that hits the spot. Alright. Mountain Dew, if you're watching this video, make me your sponsor, bro. Got my safety knife. Got this massive package. TWSS. From Mansfield, Ohio to South Bend, Indiana. This is one of the biggest unboxings I've ever done. I'm going to open this puppy up. Finally, on my work weekend, I'm so pumped. I'm tired. So. Blue bubble wrap. Blue bubble wrap. Alright, there's a whole bunch of DVDs. What I'm going to do is set it on the ground. I set it on the ground. First up, Sean Waltman shoot interview from RF Video. <coughs> AKA X Pac. AKA the guy who just ripped his butthole. Google that. Hope your butthole's okay, buddy. Yeah, he legit ripped his butthole doing the Bronco Buster last week. And he had to have emergency surgery. So, hope everything's alright, buddy. Then, that, I don't have that one. This one is Best of Bloodiest Brawls Volume 1 from TNA Wrestling, a.k.a. Impact. I do not believe I have this one. This is a potential double bit. I'm pretty sure I already have this, but it's the best of Smojo Unstoppable from TNA. This is a loose disc. What's up with that? Wow, that's a weird case. This case sucks, bro. TNA, why you hate cases? This is Scott Hall shoot interview, one of the most entertaining and compelling shoot interviews in the history of RF video. Scott Hall, aka Raise Hormone, aka DDP Yoga, number one survivor. To the set. This is Six Sides of Steel Lockdown TNA Impact. I don't think I have that one. I only I'm only gonna say if I think they're double dips. This is uh, Nevermore the Best of Raven. I do not think I have this one either. I literally know, I went to a show just because Raven was supposed to be there and he show. This is uh, Global Impact Japan, definitely double bit. Shooting me an offer on that. If you got something you think you might want to trade, let me know. Because I already have at least one copy, if not four. So, Lockdown Every War Ends in the Cage, April 15th, 27, 2007, St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, this is Bob Backlund and Macho Man Jay Lethal Black Machismo Brother. That's not a good impression. I apologize for that. Diet Mountain Dew Code Break Break. This is a two pack Best of X Division Volume 1 and 2. Double dip for me. However, I don't think I have the case, so I'll probably end up selling my other ones and keeping the case. Because I'm a bowels. Shout out to Cad316. We're both bowels. Ooh, this case is nice.
not in good shape. Not a fan. Dang. Well, I take that back. I'm going to probably keep it just because I like this slip cover. But I'm not a fan. The case is not in good condition. Oh, to the people that hate on me because I complain about uh, stickers that and broken cases and broken spindles. Um, I had some haters message me about why I complain about stickers. If I spend $45, $50 on a single DVD that is uh, marketed as being in mint condition, no blemishes, nothing like that, I expect it to be like that. So... Destination X, March 13th, 2005. Very, oh, it's the two disc. It's not two disc should be, man. I like that. Very heavy case. Wow, DDP, man. I almost forgot DDP was there, man. That's not a bad thing. That's a good thing. Slammiversary, three-year anniversary, spectacular. June 19th, 2005 with Marcus Corvan. Honey Brown. Um, shocker. Is that Shocker? I'm trying to remember. Um, yeah. The original player from the Himalaya, Sanjay Dutt. Oh my gosh. TNA Doomsday, the best of abyss. Potential double dip, I'm not sure. Thing, return of an icon, TNA. This, I could be mistaken, but I'm pretty sure I already have these. I don't think I have this case. This is Lockdown, Victory Road, and Turning Point. Now, didn't they release... There's two different covers, right? Uh, maybe not for this one, but for definitely for this one. So there's like an all black cover, if I'm not mistaken, which I already I know I have. And then three hour epic event. This has got to be at least two disc sets. Very hit, yeah. Did you two disc? Wow. I hate to say it, man. I love this case. I don't know about you, but I need a diet Mountain Dew Code Red break. Kristen Cage, instant classic, double dip, make me an offer. Bound for glory. Ooh, they put a little bubble wrap in it. Wow, classy. Wow, oh, nope. The history of TNA Year One. I'm pretty sure I could be mistaken, but isn't this one of the rarer DVDs? Let me know. If Cat 316 or Legal Zero One. Uh, let me know. Is this one of the most rare DVDs? I'm pretty sure. Best of Tag Teams Volume One. Also want to give a shout out to the Chair Shot and Corey Andy Five and Chatterman, Stevie Breach, Greatest Moments, Fifty Greatest Moments, Possible Double Dip. This is, I think, a replacement case or something. Very thick case. All right, here's the last one. Time for Glory, Time for Greatness, October twenty third, two thousand five. Alright, so that about sums it up. I uh, appreciate you watching all my videos. Um, like I said, I'm trying to sell my house. As soon as I sell my house, I'll be able to move to the next house and have my entire collection put up on display. And that code red. Oh, what a rush. And uh, I really can't wait to have my whole collection on display. I'll stop uh, buying the same ones again on accident. 
because I've done that. It's hard to remember everything you got. I'm not trying to sound like all boastful, but yeah. Um, I also want to give a shout out to uh, I think it's WWE DG 86. I want to say. Uh, I'll confirm that, but he's got like the sickest collection of all time. Uh, but I think I have, if not the best. In the, I'm definitely, I think, in the top five most complete collection on YouTube. Uh, WWEG86, I believe is his name. Uh, check out his account. Awesome. Shout out to you, dude. Um, Stevie Breach has a huge collection. But I cannot wait to showcase my entire collection. Uh, I've got a, a near complete collection, and I really hope you guys eventually will check it out. Thanks to all my subscribers, all the trolls watching this page, uh, and I hope you leave a comment, because I respond 100% of the time. If you've got a cool collection video where you're showcasing your old collection, please message me, and or leave a comment, rather, and uh, I'll check it out. Appreciate everyone once again. Yeah, representing Safety Knives, representing Tony Clippers, and uh, have a good day.